to create a slide okay so we are going to create a new uh, and name as slide okay meter and kilometer click on next so you have you have to take 3 meter and 4 meter step select this create translation repeat in the z direction and give us 4 meter distance and the link to step open base or right here this is your restriction yes okay now you have go to the general and define property for the column 0.2p and 0.2 and for columns yes okay now apply on this and this on okay up to there is no problem any problem you have <coughs> no okay. now we are going to apply the support so create fix support and this is your nodes apply yes so now we have to apply a plate we call here a plate to the slab so this is your slab area right yes now you have go to the geometry we are going back to geometry now we have add plate okay we have go to the geometry and add plate to quadrilateral <clears throat> we have four points first second third fourth right so our plate is applied okay our plate is applied so we have to specify the thickness thickness of plate so we have go to the general and choose property and for plate we go to the thickness yeah. we go for thickness how much thickness we want 150 yes we have four nodes and now this is your node 1 node 2 node 3 node 4 you have to specify the different Heights also for different nodes. Okay. Okay. And click on Add button. And assign uh, to this. Now see, I am unable to select the plate because I have chosen the which cursor, beam cursor. Now for the plate, we have to choose. Plate cursor. Plate cursor. So activate your plate cursor and select. And now assign to selected plate and assign. So R R three is are defined for the plate thickness. Yes. Yes. You can see yes. the rendered like this. Okay. Okay. So, tell me. Okay. Uh, give me the answer of my question. Uh, answer of my question. We have a plate of area four by four. Yes or no? Yes. Okay. We fix a simple. One plate of one 
single piece of a stone. Okay, we here applied a single piece. So, or we applied the different different pieces. So, which is the which have the more strength? Understand my question or not? No. Okay. No, no. Just wait. If we apply a single piece of a big stone, yeah. okay, the length is four meter and width also four meter. Four meter. Okay. And similarly, we have apply different different uh, uh, small sizes of pieces of rectangles like this. And complete the whole blade. Yes. Which have more strength? A bigger, bigger one. one. The single one. The latter one. Smaller, I guess. This piece is. Okay. <clears throat> so one. tell me one by one. Devuti, first one uh, you tell. First of all, you tell which one has the more strength. Bigger one or uh, this small small. <clears throat> Vibhuti, are you there? Yes, sir. So give answer, please. So big one. Okay. Then is then is bigger one. Okay. Bigger one. And give. Uh, bigger one. Yes, sir. I guess uh, the smaller. In pieces. Why? Tell me. Uh, Do you have a, any explanation? So, like, uh, like, uh, so, like uh, we prefer, like, if I, uh, is it, I don't know whether it is right or wrong, yeah. but uh, uh, like, if we prefer for brick wall, it will be, uh, I know it is this slab and uh, the plate and the wall is different. But yeah. uh, we prefer, uh, in, instead of concrete walls, we prefer the red brick walls. Red yeah. brick, yeah. Because it gives much more strength than the larger one. Yes, very good. Your explanation is correct. Or your yeah. answer is also correct. Okay. MJ, uh, you want to say something, Sabha? No, so on that we have uh, behalf, I think the smaller in pieces, the smaller are plates, smaller plates, number yes. of plates are preferable. Yes, yes, you are correct. Yeah. Dinesh? Hello. Uh, you are agree with Sabha or not? Yes, yes. You? Yes. MJ? MJ? Yes, sir. You are agree or not? So, uh, I didn't understand her explanation. Uh, she told us that if we go for this bigger one. Yes. Okay. Now the stress is come into this plate is more. Hmm. Because, as we know, as the my spam is uh, length is bigger, this is the chance to break in the middle. Yes. So the same concept is in this slab also. Yes. If we uh, prefer this bigger one in a single piece, okay. Remember this. Uh, there is a difference between single piece or a multi pieces, uh, multi plate. Okay. Now, if I divide this bigger piece into the smaller ones like this, this have more strength than the bigger one.
yes dear yes yes so this is the plate number 1 this is plate number 2 plate number 3 plate number 4 plate number 5 plate number 6 similarly this is have the different number so this plate has the more strength than the bigger single piece okay see how i am apply a single piece here okay okay dear yes now yes. i am going to apply the load on this plate right or all the thing uh, or elements first of all i am going to add the self uh, self weight on it i am considering the dead load on it in the dead load i have chosen self plate first add now i am going i am don't applying any member load on the means because uh, we are analyzing the slab not the beam yes so we are going to add the plate load okay we are going to add the plate load in the pl uh, plate load we have the different different loads like the pressure on full plate it act like the udl on the plate pressure on full plate yes and yes, this sir. is your concentrated load which is act as the point load on our plate okay this is your partial plate pressure load which will be going to apply the on partial plate load okay okay yes. so i am going to apply the pressure on full plate so i give the value as 2 kN per meter square or 1 okay okay choose gy direction and place add load okay no doubt any doubt no sir or close the figure and uh, apply this load assigned to you and this is also on the assigned to you. okay apply <coughs> choose run analysis print or add and analyze there is no error go to the post processing mode done apply now go to the plate here we have the another option plate in the previous one we have only node and beam now okay. here we are considering the plate also that's why we have the plate option click on here choose the maximum absolute stress this is your stress step sorry stress type apply or okay so dear c there is See the all the plate have the same stress color, yes or no? Or see the value. Yes. It means this are going to fail in your analysis because it has the red color, maximum stress color. Yes, dear. Yes. Yes. Okay. Understand? Okay. I am going to convert this big piece into the smaller pieces by creating the meshing. Creating the meshing. Okay. So this mesh is uh, if uh, this mesh look like the strip. or creating the uh, iron wall meshing okay this is the okay. meshing of strips your reinforcement okay choosing the okay uh, select this plate and uh, go to the geometry and choose yes, generate plate mesh Choose 
quadrilateral helicon okay so this is the length ab bc cd and da and how many divisions you have going to create 10 so the length in the mm you have 4000 mm okay now the difference uh, distance between the two divisions is how much 400 divided by 10 divided by 10 it means 400 4000 yeah. 400 yeah yeah 400 so you are going to increase or decrease this this gap actually this distance is your bar distance distance between the, your bars yes your steel bars okay yes yeah. so 400 is okay yes yes okay now you have to go to the apply yes So see, this is your small pieces of plate of four hundred by four hundred. Yes or no? Yes. So now uh, you just go and apply the thickness is already applied. Yes. Now go to the analyze again. Yes. So go to the post processing mode. Apply or select the plate. Choose maximum absolute and see. This is your perfect stress diagram of your plate. You see, we have the maximum stress in the center. Yes, and this is your values of your stress according to the color. Yes, dear. Yes. Yes. So you got the answer of why we use the plate matching. Yes or no? Yes. So this is how we analyze the slab. Okay, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. After that, the same procedure is followed to design the slab. You click on modeling. Go to the design. Yes. Choose concrete. And now go for the IS two five six and assign your parameters. So we are not going to define the this time clear cover because I want to show you the stat pro is taken as a default value for your cover for beam, column, and slab also. Yes. Okay. Now. You choose the strength of concrete is two five triple zero. Yes. And F by main, F main, F by main is the heel strength of your main reinforcement concrete, right? Yes. Sorry, main yes. reinforcement steel. See the note for the slab. It is reinforcement used in the both the direction. It means in the for the slab we have x or z direction, okay? Yes. Yes. That's why f by main is considered for the in the both direction for the slab only, okay? Yes. So that's why we use four one five x and f by secondary, f by secondary only used in the yeah. beam yeah. design. Beam yeah. design. Here we have the beam also. That's why we are going to applying what four one five and and this is your main main twelve max beam 
and this is your max secondary 10 and min min 10 and min secondary 8 right here up to this any problem no uh, sir now i am going to apply this assign to view assign assign See, the number bars is not assigning on the plane. Now go to the command window. Now we have the beams, add, we have column, add, we have slab, add, we have take off and take. And now apply beam on the beams. This is your beams and assign to selected beam. Yes, this is your column. Assign this here. And this is your slab. So go for the slab cursor. See, this is your slab. And assign it to selected slabs. Now, go to the analyze and run analysis. And go to the output file. Go to the result. Concrete design. See, this is your beams. And go for the plate design. We already discussed about the beam and column designing, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So this is your design element summary. Okay. This is your design element summary. This is your longitudinal reinforcement. Okay. In the square mm per meter. This is your movement. And this is your transverse reinforcement. This is parallel. Longitudinal means parallel, parallel to X. Yes, dear. And the transverse is parallel to Z. So this is the top reinforcement in the what in area. Okay. Area of steel. We have one fifty six square mm per meter. Okay. So you have to choose what size you are going to. Add in the plate. If you go for the 10 mm reinforcement, you uh, go. Uh, if you choose the 12 mm reinforcement, you have to choose. So for 12, you have to choose the two bars. So 12, uh, what is the area? Tell me. Y R square cross sectional area. Okay, dear. Let's cut your part. So, like this, you are going to choose your cross sectional area in the top and bottom in the longitudinal or in the transverse. This is your plate number 12, plate number 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. This is your plates. Okay, dear. Yes. Any doubt? In the slab design, uh, statue doesn't show the bar size. This 
you have to choose the bar size according to the area required area okay dear so this is okay. your take off 8 mm bars you have to choose 7 172 newton and for 10 mm bar you have 387 and 12 mm bar you have 418 this is your total yes dinesh you want to ask him something dinesh 